Well, hello, Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. here. I pray that you're having a great day. And as you can see, I have a mighty man of God standing right beside me, my second assistant. He's also the president of our men's department, and he's the president of our in-house leadership conference that we have here annually at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. And I'm speaking of the elder Anthony Wilson. I'm excited about this man Amen. of God. And you know what? I got I got something to tell you. We're going to do a duo tonight. We're going to be, we're, hey, listen, we're going to give the devil a, a, a one-two knockout punch. Uh, Batman and Robin, Green Hornet and Kato, uh, the Lone Ranger and Tonto, whatever you want to call it. Right. We are excited about what God is about to do at the upper room, and we want you to be a part of it because in this day and time, mm. the leaders in the church, we need to be on point. We need to be together. We need to move and act as a well-oiled machine uh. because the adversary out there is trying to destroy us, trying to redefine the church, yes, sir. redefine what church is, redefine how we gather, uh. redefine how we interact. And, and, and Elder Wilson, I'm, I'm determined that we're not changing. We were not going to change. Man, talk to us. Get, let the people know a little bit about what's getting ready to happen, man of God. Appreciate you, Bishop. Yes, God sir. bless you, yes, sir. sir. Everybody, tonight is going to be the kickoff. And it's going to be powerful. As Bishop Wooden has already shared, he has graciously forgive, given me access to preach on the same ticket with him. I'm honored, man. I'm honored, yes, Bishop. Sir. Yes, sir. Looking forward to us sharing the gospel of Jesus Christ. As you heard our leader say, we must prepare the mm -hmm. minds yes, of the leaders for this day and time mm -hmm. that we're in. We want to use the Bible as our guide mm. and our example Hallelujah. as we lead in the kingdom work. Amen. Then on Friday night, we're going to have a power packed time. Amen. I'm talking about a time of building, a time of introspect, a time of education yes, sir. and the opportunity for us to come together and it'll all be done socially, Hallelujah. socially distancing. Yep, yep. All of that is still at the forefront, Amen. but every leader at the upper room, hear my heart when I tell you, Bishop Wooden looks forward to pouring into you during the Vision Keepers mm -hmm. time. And I want you to know there are some exciting things in store for you that's going to strengthen your resolve as we move forward in doing God's work. Now, when does the conference end? I'm glad you asked. That's <laughs> on Sunday morning. I want everyone to join in. If you're local, make your way to the upper room. And if you're not, join in by Facebook, join by YouTube. Amen. Closing Amen. out the conference will be done by none other than this awesome man of God. I'm talking about the pastor of the upper room, my pastor, Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. And trust me when I tell you, lo these 26 years, I have never been disappointed when it comes to him proclaiming oh God's truth. Well, I tell you, thank you for those kind words. It's going to be amazing yes, tonight. Um, but right before we close, how many years have you chaired this conference, man of God? It is going on 14 years, Bishop. 14, 14 years. years. And you know what? The, I believe it's one of the reasons why we walk in a certain level of success here. Hallelujah. Because there is a level of expectancy. Yes, sir. Hey, we're not perfect, mm -hmm. but we're working on it. Amen. We're headed toward it. Yes, sir. And, and we are working on our leaders. Ah, thank you, Jesus. And, and let me tell you something. Our position is not that leaders have privilege only. Right. But leaders have responsibility. There it is. And if you can't live up to the responsibility of leading, mm. then uh, we need to get someone who can yes, because sir. we need people. I can't overemphasize how important it is mm. for the, the leadership to be tight yes, sir. in these last days. Yes, sir. So, man, I'm excited about hearing what you have to say. I thank God for you. I thank God for the leader that you are. Hallelujah. I thank God for your, your family. He's a family man. Yes, sir. And, and his family, his wife, his children, they're saved and loved Hallelujah. the Lord. Hallelujah. And, and been a part of this church. And I, I thank God, man of God, for you. Now, tonight, you got to meet us. Hallelujah. Right here at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ, we're going to do a tag team Bible study. Hallelujah. <laughs> yeah, man. Bible study. Bible study. We are going to study 
the word of the Lord together. Join us on Facebook. Join us yes, on sir. YouTube. And if you can, come out and join us live because it's going to be something. God bless you. Make it a great day. Man, thank you. Thank you, Bishop. God yes, bless sir. you.